Hey everyone, how's it going? Azrin the Language Nerd here. I hope you are doing very, very well. Welcome to another episode of Super Easy English. In today's episode, we are going to discuss some vocabulary words that you need when going to a library. In this video, we are going to visit the central library in my city, which is Calgary in, in Canada, which is the newest or one of the newest libraries that we have in the city. The central library is a very unique library. It is not like most libraries in, in the world. First of all, the library is very, very big and the inside of the library is extremely spacious. Spacious is a word that means very open. When you walk inside, you feel like it is really big because the space between all of the bookshelves and all of the books, the space between everything is really big. Inside this library, you will see things that are not common in many libraries in other places. For example, there is a coffee shop, there are, um, there are workrooms where you can work privately with, with a couple of friends or with a couple of co-workers. Um, there is even a large chess set and you can play chess. Um, there, is a, there is an area where children can play and it's a very nice place to spend time. The Central Library in Calgary is a very popular place um, and has been a very popular place since it, since it opened a little bit less than one year ago. The Central Library is very beautiful as you have seen and as we have now discussed in this video, but it is still a library and there are many different things inside that you will see that you will see in all, if not most, libraries. One of these common things is a hold. Now, hold has many meanings. Hold can mean, for example, oops, <laughs> I spilled water on my shirt. <laughs> hold can mean hold like this. Right now, I'm holding this cup. <laughs> but in a library, hold has a different, has a different meaning. Hold is a noun. Um, a hold means if you want to get a book from the library, but the book is not available right now, you can place a hold. This means that when the book comes back to the library, when somebody returns the book to the library, they, the library will contact you and then you can go to the library and collect the book. All of the libraries in Calgary have computers inside of them that have different options that you can select. For example, there is an option that says search the catalog. When you, when you click the option, search the catalog, you are able to look for, you're able to search, type in some of the books that you are looking for. And you can see if the book that you are looking for is available at the, at the library. If the book is not available, you can place a hold for that book. If it is available, the computer will tell you where to find that book in the library. On the library computers, you will also see a section, a button that says become a member. If you want to use the libraries in, in Calgary, you have to have a library card. In Calgary, the library cards are actually free. So anybody can go to the library and get a free library card. All of the library computers also have a button that says hours and location. Hours and location is very simple. It tells you about when the library is open and where the library is located. In other words, the address for the library. The last two buttons that you will see on these computers is today's events and find a program. The libraries in Calgary, especially the central library, has many different events and many programs. There are lots of different types of programs. There are programs for children, programs for teenagers, programs for adults. There are art programs. There are dance programs. 
There are programs for immigrants who recently arrived to Canada. There are, there's lots of different things that happen at the library. And because of this, many people visit the library. Many people enjoy going to the library because of the different events and activities that you can find there. Well, everyone, thank you so much for watching this video. I appreciate your attention. Um, if you have any questions or comments at all, feel free to write them in the comment section and I will answer them for you. And uh, yeah, I will see you in the next video. Bye for now. Yeah, you should sunbathe. I was gonna say wind, like the in Wind Waker. Yeah. That's what I was gonna reference. Wind Waker. Yeah. When you're, when you're in a temple and you're going through yep. the dungeon. Yep. And on top there's a boss somewhere, right? <laughs>